Welcome back to the Lights Out Podcast. Bedtime stories for boys and girls for when the lights go out. Good evening, boys and girls. Are you ready for bed? Are you all snuggled up and ready for another Lights Out Bedtime Story? Well, you're in for a treat tonight because I've just found a book in my house that I didn't know was here. And so I'm going to read it tonight for you. It's called The Elephant and the Bad Baby by Elfrida Vipont and illustrated by Raymond Briggs. And a big shout out goes to all the new and existing authors who are supporting the Ad Free Forever show. A thousand stories for bedtime is our mission. And a super duper big shout out to the listeners who are also supporting the Ad Free Forever show. And tonight's shout out goes to Holly Myers. Thank you so much. I hope that your little ones are enjoying the show. So, without further ado, let's begin this story. Once upon a time, Once upon a time, there was an elephant. And one day, the elephant went for a walk, and he met a bad baby. And the elephant said to the bad baby, Would you like a ride? And the bad baby said, Yes. So the elephant stretched out his trunk, and picked up the bad baby, and put him on his back. And they went rumpeter, 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 all down the road. Very soon, they met an ice cream man, and the elephant said to the bad baby, "Would you like an ice cream?" And the bad baby said, "Yes." So the elephant stretched out his trunk and took an ice cream for himself, and an ice cream for the bad baby. And they went rumpeter, 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 all down the road, with the ice cream man running after. Next, they came to a pork butcher's shop, and the elephant said to the bad baby, "Would you like a pie?" And the bad baby said, "Yes." So the elephant stretched out his trunk and took a pie for himself and a pie for the bad baby. And they went rumpeter, 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 all down the road, with an ice cream man and the pork butcher both running after. Next, they came to a baker's shop, and the elephant said to the bad baby, "Would you like a bun?" And the bad baby said, "Yes." So the elephant stretched out his trunk and took a bun for himself. And a bun for the bad baby, and they went rumpeter, 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 all down the road, with the ice cream man, and the pork butcher, and the baker, all running after. Next, they came to a snack bar, and the elephant said to the bad baby, "Would you like some crisps?" And the bad baby said, "Yes." So the elephant stretched out his trunk and took some crisps for himself and some crisps for the bad baby, and they went rumpeter, 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 all down the road with the ice cream man and the pork butcher and the baker and the snack bar man all running after. Next, they came to a grocer's shop, and the elephant said to the bad baby. Would you like a chocolate biscuit? And the bad baby said, "Yes." So the elephant stretched out his trunk and took a chocolate biscuit for himself and a chocolate biscuit for the bad baby. And they went rumpeter, 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 all down the road, with the ice cream man and the pork butcher and the baker and the snack bar man and the grocer. All running after. Next, they came to a sweet shop, and the elephant said to the bad baby, "Would you like a lollipop?" And the bad baby said, "Yes." 
So the elephant stretched out his trunk and took a lollipop for himself and a lollipop for the bad baby. And they went rumpeter, rumpeter, rumpeter all down the road with the ice cream man and the pork butcher and the baker and the snack bar man and the grocer and the lady from the sweet shop all running after. Next, they came to a fruit barrel and the elephant said to the bad baby, Would you like an apple? And the bad baby said, Yes. So the elephant stretched out his trunk and took an apple for himself and an apple for the bad baby. And they went rumpeter, rumpeter, rumpeter all down the road with the ice cream man and the pork butcher and the baker and the snack bar man and the grocer and the lady from the sweet shop and the barrow boy all running after. Then the elephant said to the bad baby, But you haven't once said please. And then he said, You haven't once said please. Then the elephant sat down suddenly in the middle of the road and the bad baby fell off. And the ice cream man and the pork butcher and the baker and the snack bar man and the grocer and the lady from the sweet shop and the barrow boy all went bump into a heap. And the elephant said, But he never once said please. And the ice cream man and the pork butcher and the baker and the snack bar man and the grocer and the lady from the sweet shop and the barrow boy all picked themselves up and said just fancy that he never once said please and the bad baby said please I want to go home to my mummy so the elephant stretched out his trunk and picked up the bad baby and put him on his back and they went rumpeter, rumpeter, rumpeter all down the road with the ice cream man and the pork butcher and the baker and the snack bar man and the grocer and the lady from the sweet shop and the barrow boy all running after. When the bad baby's mummy saw them, she said, Have you come for tea? And they all said, Yes, please. So they all went in and had tea and the bad baby's mummy made pancakes for everybody. Then the elephant went rumpeter, rumpeter, rumpeter all down the road with the ice cream man and the pork butcher and the baker and the snack bar man and the grocer and the lady from the sweet shop and the barrow boy all running after. And the bad baby went to bed. The end. Wow. I don't know why. I've never read that before. A book in my house. The Elephant and the Bad Baby by Alfreda Vipant illustrated by Raymond Briggs. Rumpeter, rumpeter, rumpeter. Here on the Lights Out Podcast. Bedtime stories for boys and girls like you. Good night.